Hello everybody, welcome back to youtube.com slash geekaloud for another Let's Install today, Max Payne 3. Why Max Payne 3, I hear you ask? Because Xbox added another bunch of games to the backwards compatibility program overnight. Very exciting. So the big ones for me, Max Payne 3, but then also the Dead or Alive, Dead or Alive 4 and 5. I've got two of the old uh, Xbox 360 arcade sticks from Dead or Alive 4. I'm keen to find out whether the inclusion of Dead or Alive 4 into the back compatibility now supports those controllers, the fighting sticks. Hopefully it does, but that's not what we're here for today. Today, we're here for Max Payne 3. As I just said, added to the Xbox Game Pass back compatibility. Let's install on youtube.com slash eagle out.
installed Max Payne 3. Why Max Payne 3? It just got added. It's beautiful. Let's uh, let's boot it up. I'm sure it's all there. Surely these older games, it's all going to be there in the first hit, but we must always boot it up and check on the installs. We must guarantee the install is 100%. Complete. So as I was saying, uh, this just got announced today. And also, if you take a nice close look there, there's also Dead or Alive 4 and 5. They're the key ones I'm excited about. But check out that full list. Maybe there's one that resonates a bit more strongly with you that you want to see installed on the channel. If so, no worries at all. Send me a message and I would happily install any of them. Just got to let me know the ones you want to see. Max Payne 3, that's what I want to see. Where's that menu? Man, this game was so good when it came out. I can't wait. Even just to see the opening scene again where we jump through the nightclub and the bullet time. It's all very exciting. Very keen to see what the uh, backwards compatibility on the Series X looks like. You know, do we get the 60 frames a second? What's that HDR look like? All the good stuff. And it will be fascinating to see how the HDR looks. Such a big fan of the Max Payne series. All right, now let's have a look. Let's check it out. What have we got? Story, okay, multiplayer settings. I don't think they would have changed anything here. That all looks standard. Okay, if we go into story, hmm, we can't continue. I wonder if there's any way to pull down those save data. No, it's probably on the old 360, I would think. There we have it, Max Payne 3 installed. It's all there. Let's pull up the uh, particulars now uh, and drive this here install all the way home. Uh, as I said, so just added today, whoop, part of uh, Xbox backwards compatibility program. They've just expanded the library. Fingers crossed they add all their rock band and guitar heroes. I've got all those old gear. I want them to add it. But this is Max Payne 3. It is 13.3 gigs. And are you ready for the version number? It's 21.921.2242.1901. That has been a successful install here on youtube.com slash geekloud. I remind you, check out the Gaming Enforcement Agency Monday nights, 8 p.m.-ish, right here with myself and Unky Dunky going over all the cool things that happened in video gaming this week. Come along, you'll love it, I promise. It's an awesome time. What else can you do with Geek Loud? Like it, subscribe it. You'll never miss it. Old Uncle Donkey. Donkey. <laughs> 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 <laughs>